Right, I am back. As I said, that was a momentary break. And we're swapping over to my time at Sandrock. I got myself a beer, went to the loo, and we're going to get going. Last time, we managed to... Ooh. We managed to go to the abandoned, like, submarine thing, find that gel stuff. And now they want us to uh, place some out in the... Yeah, test it and see if we can grow crops out there. We've also got Yakmel now. All four of them. Uh, we made a couple of expansions, so things are going well. Mm -mm. Roses. Hmm. Cool. What am I crafting this for? Oh, for the intermediate planting kit. That was good. And boom. I don't need the old one, do I? Wait until tomorrow, sounds lovely. Make sure we've got plenty of that going. Anything restoration wise I need? No. Okay. We're 11 days into winter. Oh, I need to go get chickens, but we'll do that tomorrow before we oversleep. No, oh, we, we just came back. We just switched, swapped over to the game. Yep, how you doing, my man? We just made our intermediate planting kit. Howdy there. So, I heard you had a pretty crazy time in the shipwreck ruins. Wasn't too tough for you. No sweat. Well, dang. You're tougher than the sand and rocks around here, huh? Wish I could have seen what that caretaker bot was like before you took it down. Well, we did an initial check. There are still some old world AIs roaming around. But the poison gas you ran into seems to have dissipated. Yeah, it's just tab. So, we're thinking of opening it up as a hazardous ruin. Cool. Let people dive around, see what has gotten in store. For we'll that do. to happen, we'll need a ladder to get in. I can tell you right now, we ain't throwing anyone else in. That was clearly against regulation. Zeke, man, we'll also need to fix the two doors that you builders and the mayor used to enter and exit the place. So, what do you say? I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah sure. I was going to have Ryan do the ladder, <laughs> but you know him. I ain't going to get anything back until a couple of seasons later because this is extra work. Mm -hmm. So I turn to you. Once you have the recipe, I think you're supposed to build it on your work table. Install it outside the shipwreck ruins after you're done. You know the drill. As for the doors, just bring some materials. I'm sure you can do your thing on site. Anyway, thanks a bunch. It's nice to be able to. Oh, yeah, that was fucking hilarious. See, just picking up the old lady and just yeeting her across the screen. <laughs> You both want to hang out? Uh, well, Grace, let's start with you. Hmm. Oh, I, I can't. Bye. Why are you asking to hang out when you can't hang out? Oh, that's uh, the pot. Yeah, thank you, my dear. Nia. Thanks for the jerky. Also need to go get some chickens today.
I'm sorry, I wish you could just have stayed small like that because you were freaking adorable. a lot of money. Get both of those going. Let's go some get some chicken. that we found in the poop. Lovely. Baby rooster, baby hen. Um... Four and two? Hey, Zoo. How you doing? Willkommen. Do we have any research going on with what's his face? Do not cut trees. I repeat, do not cut. What what is normal sleep schedule? I have never heard such a thing. Definitely nothing in uh, no, definitely not something I've ever experienced. Mm -hmm. uh, you like power cores, don't you? Thank you. That is true. I have only read of tales of it in books and in manuscripts of legend. Prophesied thing called sleep. Sleep's just where you drink more coffee, right? Or something caffeine. Me being tea. He's out there. Let's go get let's go get super depressed real quick by Mort because that's what he does. That's that's all he does. Depressing though. Like, oh, look at all these people. This is before all our hopes and dreams were smashed. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> ah, this photo. Oh, thank you. This is the photo I'd hoped most we'd be able to find. This, of course, is our wedding day. Everything was perfect then. Everything was perfect then. Then the Fire Nation attacked. Never was there a more picture-perfect model of Telesis than on that day. We all shared that oasis. Not one of us was wanting. 
And as our little camp grew in numbers, so too did our family. That day, we thought we'd chosen a fate to live forever in paradise. Let's just say, it's hard for me to believe in that old light doctrine. Everything happens for a reason. Thank you. Jesus, mate. <laughs> I, can't, I can't with you. I, I just can't. You're too much, sir. <laughs> Here be right, yo. Down our horse. How long until the rhino cactus is done? done in a second no hang on five days and 40 okay never mind i thought that little first bit Shits. Um, so far you like mushrooms, you like potatoes. What are you? Tomatoes? I'm just gonna add one of each until I figure out what it is you like. Like that's that's a decent way to go about that. I, I keep forgetting I can't do that. Everybody's helping out, putting down the back rest. Hey there. Thank you. Boom. Okay, we're now buddy with him, which boosted everything else. Trudy. Glad you could make it. Come on, let's get started. We're a long way from our goal. Oh, by the way, here's some water for the trees. All right, I think that's enough chit chat. Let's get going. Oh, damn. The same game. I'll show you how you little shit how it's done. It's 
they give me fertilizer as well I like how they're leaving gaps I'm leaving zero gaps Did they want me to continue how they were doing I guess it is meant to be trees There's only 10 of them, so... Hmm... water a thing damn do you mind horse get off the bloody crops okay Oh hell no, I'm not spending my fertilizer on that. You guys can suck it. Unless you give me fertilizer. Thanks for the assist. I think we'll just have to wait and see how it goes. I'm hoping for the best. Got turn into sand later? How do you know? Maybe there's just so much sand that it got condensing or turned into rock. <laughs> I'm guessing you just noticed my title. I just I, I just thought of something stupid and put it in. As you do. Hmm. Yeah, that that one I feel like is gonna be good for boosting. written on it well have fun with that Drop off ship. That's a painting spot. Yeah, it's going to take a little over five days for those trees to mature, so if I have to wait for story, then I'm just going to about other things you know speaking of which I should I have a, the chromium hammer now can I break through this shit now oh, wait, did I ever make the planks for this thing
Mm. Oh my goodness gracious me. You make me un poco loco. No way, you keep me guessing. I'm nodding and I'm guessing. Bunch of loot there. Okay, so I should really get back, empty out my stuff. See, Ooh. I still don't know where she hidden where she hit that chest, unless it was the chest that was hidden underneath this walkway here. Then I got that already, way before she even told me about it. Okay, you're talking about. I went in there, I couldn't find anything. Unless I'm absolutely bloody blind, which is plausible. Oh my god, inventory, please stop it. Bad conditions. Do we know what food they like? They like chestnuts. There you go, eat some tomatoes. Little, little baby poops. Nice to eat through the shit you don't like. Oh my god, I'm broke. Is it? I, I don't know. I I just grew the stuff because I had it. I you know did not know what it did. Oh, 
Oh, look at the little baby tree. Oh, we got mail. Thanks for the single cantaloupe. Fish porridge? Gross. I, I, I'm really not a fan of fish. Something going on in the commission? Tori, when you work with the Commerce Guild of Sandrock, you're working with a name you can trust. Our motto is truth, honesty, integrity, and uh... you're full of shit, Jan. Ah, what a coincidence! If it isn't the hardest working builder in Sandrock, lovely Katori, if you please, I don't care allow my subordinate to make your acquaintance. This is gross. Bridges, hydrogels, that's, jerky. That's our star builder does it all. Our uh, yes. I believe I'm familiar. Yes, yes. Builder and me and were total newbies when they first came to Sandrock. No, but don't even try and wing, take any credit. I swear to God. Into old bees. Ha. Top workshop owner. No, no don't matter the size or difficulty of your project, I'm boastfully confident my brilliant builders won't bungle it. You tell them yourself, Builder. Better than this guy here. <laughs> Good one, Builder. Yes, see, Madam Katori, us at the Commerce Guild are all thick as thieves. We like to rib each other a bit, have a little bit of playful banter. You're horrible, and I hate you, and your yard is extremely ugly. Really do something about it, Builder. <laughs> see? It of course, up. uh, like I was saying, I'm familiar with the quality of their work. <laughs> yes, a true businesswoman you are. What's the problem? Well, the short of it is, I'm planning on expanding the Golden Goose Gaming Extravel Plaza. Right now, we only have, like, two games. Who would want to come to Sandrock just to visit a dinky shack like what I got now? Two games better than zero games. Now, now, don't say that. Your game center is known across the land already for its, um, uh, splendid, uh, woodiness. Yeah, it is rather, uh, well, it's fine. But the competition out there is vicious. We can't get left behind. That's why we gotta expand, renovate, start paving the way towards the future. Oh, yes, future. <laughs> You've gotta have that. Let's talk specifics, then. What exactly are you hoping to have built in this expansion project? Well, I'm gonna need a new storefront, a new sign, start a catalog of new games. My, what big dreams you have for your extra blazer the thing. Before I forget, perhaps we ought to first discuss one. Oh, yeah. Well, I figured since this was such a sure thing, I could just promise you guys a portion of the profits oh, once they roll in. Oh, Jan won't go for It'll that. It'll be real fair for all of us, and... Um, oh, so, uh, what you're saying is, you don't have the money for the project. Uh, well, in a matter of speaking... I guess you could say I don't. 